Hi, Katie, Emma, Wendy, Marie, Suzanne, Molly, Sue, Denise, Lucy. Hello, 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 hello. Hi, Sylvia. Hi, Kate. Hello. Hi, Becky. Good evening. How are we all? It's Friday night. My kids are loving that song at the moment. <laughs> How is everyone? Oh, how, which one is it? That's the one. Let me pop that over there. So that way I know where I'm going to. Uh, hi, Claire, Tony, Carol, Trisha. Hi, Kelly. Sue, bless you. Thank you for the stars and the appreciation there. Kirsty, hello. I'm fine. Thank you, Billy Joe. I hope you're well as well. I've got real frizzy hair today, but it's just, it just wouldn't be tamed and I just couldn't couldn't tame it so yeah I apologize I look like a frizzy, <laughs> frizzy. <laughs> fine I just couldn't tame it it's one of those days uh just a no sound your end has everyone else got sound um hi hello 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 six months till Christmas day oh my gosh Oh my gosh, I mean, I think I need to start planning. Because, <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, so. Oh gosh, hello Janine, Stella Marie, hi Karen and Angela, good evening Sharon, hello Sarah, Linda, bless you, thank you for the stars, 23 week streak, thank you my lovely, um, hi Marlene, Sophie, Blossom, hello, okay so, just thinking i have a lot of new stock going on the website over the next couple of days um i was gonna see if i could show you some but it's all bagged up because I've, I've sorted it all out today so it's going to be going on the website over the next couple of days which is very, very exciting. We've still got new stock on the website, which only went on a few days ago, uh, but do keep an eye out on the website and then we can, um, yeah, I'll update you as and when the changes happen. Um, other than that, I think that's all the updates. So, shall we jump straight in for today? We do still have spaces available for today. Uh, so if you would like to order, uh, I will add you onto the end of the order list as we get to the end of this one. I've just updated the order list as well on the page. So if you have ordered to, for today, uh, you should be on the order list that's been posted on the page. That's a little bit down the page now. Yep, Kerry, there are still some spaces for tonight. So shall we jump in? I'm just going to, before I touch oysters, see if I can grab my lip stuff I can it's right here okay so I can feel my lips already starting to crack so unless I put something on then it's, it's a disaster uh, Sabrina bless you thank you for the stars there and Betty Jane thank you as well okay so uh, oh and we've got all oysters available today all oysters available up first is Kate Seaman. Kate, are you here?
Hello, Jess. Good evening. We're not doing the cage pendants again. Cage pendants are on the website, Janine. Uh, what do you mean? Do you mean like the cage pendant uh, wall or the dip? Do you mean that? But we do have all of the cage pendants on the website uh, now. Kate, hello. Okay, so Kate, you have got uh, one opening altogether. What type of oyster would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? What do you think? Oh, shiver. <laughs> Hello. Bless you, Laura. Thank you for the stars there. Five week streak. Thank you, my lovely. Oh, wow, Donna, thank you for the stars and the appreciation there. Your first time, well, thank you very, very much. It's very kind of you. Uh, now, Kate, like I say, you've got the one opening all together. Um, what type of oyster would you like and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Mystery oyster, donate your shells. Okay, oh. So, mystery oyster, let's dive in and let's get him open. Okay, so let's go down. Now, I may need to readjust. No, I don't. It's perfect. I was going to say I may need to readjust this camera, but no, because I knocked it just as I went live. <laughs> but I do think it's okay. So, is there a certain colour you're hoping for, Kate? your mystery oyster softer pop there now there's your mother of pearl and in here you're hoping for a sea green okay it's not a sea green you have a lemon yellow and there's no more in that one. So you have a lemon yellow, Kate. Now, if you would like to, you can swap this for a sea green, but of course, if you're happy with this one, then that's perfect as well. So you can see the lemon yellow there beautifully. And if I pop him in the sand for you, the ones where you pick the cage pendants off the wall, Janine, I see. Uh, well, we do have a, a new event coming up next week, uh, so just keep an eye out on the page and on the website. That is the same, James, yes. Now, Kate, if I pop this on the board for you, lemon yellow number one is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5. He is a seven. So what do you think to this one? Are you happy with this one? But if not, I can swap him for you. It does, Helen. I'm wearing <laughs> I'm wearing a bright yellow top today. So the amount of bees that have been attracted to this top today is crazy. <laughs> the bees are definitely definitely out and I've sort of just stood there still waiting for it to move on and realise that I'm not a flower <laughs> you would like to swap for a sea green of course you can let me grab a sea green for you uh, would this one be okay are you happy with that one there Let me bring you back up again. 
Yeah, I forgot about it, Helen, to be honest, because I haven't really seen many bees around, but all the flowers are starting to bloom outside now, so the bees are here, <laughs> and on the school run with the bees, it's, it was fine, they don't attack, do they? It's just, <laughs> stand still. Uh, Kate, I hope you're happy with that one, let me pop this on here for you. Lindsay, bless you, thank you for the stars there. Uh, perfect Kate so thank you for the donations of your shells and I hope then you'll be happy with everything once it arrives and that's safe up there for you okay and up next then is now I'm going to be looking for Kelly Zubanshi. I hope I pronounced that correctly. Kelly, are you here? Heidi, hi. Jodie, bless you. Thank you for the stars as well. 11 week streak. Thank you, my lovely. Kelly, hello. So Kelly, just confirm for me, am I just looking out for your name on here or am I looking out for a different name? Oh, bless you, Kate. You're very welcome. And well done you for rescuing the bees. But gosh, for some it must be a continuous task. It's called the Leap Charm, Michelle. Speaking on behalf, your name. Okay, Kelly, perfect. So to start with then, I have a little message, message sorry, to read. So I'm going to read it as it's written, okay? It says, Paula, this is a special, special message just for you. Happy belated birthday, mummy. We love you, love Belle and Ben. So I'll read that one more time. Paula, this is a special message just for you. Happy belated birthday, mummy. We love you. Love, Belle and Ben. So, Paula, you have one opening altogether. Uh, what type of oyster would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? animal charms Michelle although if you type leap charm into the search bar it will bring it up as well what do you think Paula so you've got one opening all together keep the shells that's perfect what type of oyster would you like? So we've got mystery oysters, which is a sort of just a mix of all the colours. We've got the new new rainbow oysters, which are darker rainbow colours. We've got expand the rainbow colours, which are lighter rainbow colours, and then normal natural colours as well. So a mix of all the colours, lighter rainbow, darker rainbow, or normal natural what do you think which type of oyster would you like or what color are you hoping for and then i can direct you to the best oyster hi paul <laughs> mystery okay perfect mystery and keeping your shells is there a certain color that you're hoping for 
so let me get this one open and let's go down so your mystery oyster oh look at that i did not see that i'm not a hundred percent what it is but it's shiny and hard <laughs> Okay, so we have a softer pop there. Oh, and in here, you are twinning. You are twinning with watermelon twins. So watermelon is sort of a pinky coral color. And there's no more in that one. Now, with these watermelon twins, I can definitely see that they're two tonal. And I can see that they are visually slightly different in size as well. So let me show you each pearl individually. And if you're happy with these, I'll need to know which one you'd like on your jewellery. If you're not happy, I can swap one or both of these colours as well. Okay, so if I show you the visually smaller of the two it does look like he's more two tonal so he's got the lighter and then the, so that's the brighter and then the lighter areas as you go around there and then moving on to pearl number two now this is the la visually larger and this is slightly less two tonal but it's definitely brighter overall okay so if i pop them both in the sand and hold them up so you can have a closer look what do you think to these janet 30 week streak that's wow thank you my lovely thank you for the stars there so a visually smaller two tonal watermelon and then a larger brighter watermelon what do you think to these if i pop them on the board for visually smaller of the two it's not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. And then number 2 is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. So they are measuring at slightly different sizes there as well. Keep them both perfect. Would you like the smaller or the larger one on the jewellery? Samantha, thank you for the stars and I hope you have a brilliant weekend as well. Elizabeth, they don't come with a chain. However, if you request them to be on a hoop fitting, we do then sell chains on the website or it will be able to slide onto a chain that you may have at home. So would you like the visually or the smaller or the larger pearl? The smaller one, perfect. Let me bring you back up here. And I'll write that down in just a second. Let me wrap up these shells for you. So Paula, from us, I hope you've had a brilliant birthday as well. And I hope you'll both be happy with everything once it arrives. Just popping your name on there. And then we're going to have the smaller watermelon. Okay, perfect. And if I pop these on here for you okay so like i say i hope you'll both be happy with everything once it arrives and that's safe up there for you perfect and up next a uh, biggest pearl we've had is a nine and smallest is a six so far uh, up next is Marlene Galanti. Marlene, are you here? No, Kelly, you're very, very welcome. Shannon, thank you for the stars there. Marlene, hello. Okay, so Marlene, you've got a four pearl oyster and then you've got four oysters as well. So I'll grab the four pearl oyster. What four other oysters would you like? 
and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells so like so this is your four pearl oyster what other four oysters would you like and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells Still a tiny bit hot, that tea. <laughs> so two, two big gulps. Still a touch hot for two big gulps. Donate two natural, two light rainbow, and the rest mystery. And the rest mystery. So you two, have I? Ah. So you've got four, five, six, seven, and a four pearl oyster. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> um, too natural. Oh, I just need to top this bag up. Those two are okay for now. Too natural. To expand the rainbow, I, I do have the naturals. Um, I brought them in here. I just need to top up the bag. Um, so if you would like them, guys, they're still available. And then three mystery. Donating the shells as well. Okay, so Marlene, are there certain colours that you're hoping for the first gulp did julie yeah but i kind of if i think about it i like to do things in evens it's a little bit of an ocd <laughs> it's not a big one it's just yeah i like to um so like if i if i poke something now i've just said it i'm going to be poking the oysters like it like i meant like if i poke aaron i'd have to do it twice or if he like nudged me i'd ha he'd have to do it again um like just yeah things in evens so yeah with it with a tea if i'm thinking about it sometimes i can get away if i'm not if i'm like distracted i can just have one sip but normally it needs to be the double <laughs> okay so let's go down seven oysters and a four pearl oyster they are all down here um let's get them open like I say is there certain colors that you're hoping for mystery oyster number one pink or bright purple or sea green okay so there's your mother of pearl and let's have a squidge in here your first pearl out is a Coral, and there's no more in that one. So let me dry him up and hold him up so you can see. Yep, let me move the knife up here. There we go. So your first pearl out is a coral. Moving on to mystery oyster number two. We have a lighter pop there again. Oh, and you have a runaway with a sunshine yellow there. There's your mother of pearl. And let me just have a squidge in here. There's no more in that one. So you have a sunshine yellow. And let me hold him up so you can see. Oh, that's just piece of, there we go. Then moving on to your last of the mystery oysters. Oh, again, quite a nice deep pop there. There's your mother of pearl. And in here, again, I can see a slight peep of through the flesh there. You have a Pepsi blue, a slightly darker Pepsi blue. And there's no more in that one. 
So coral, yellow and Pepsi blue from your mystery oysters. Then moving on to your next oysters. Now with these ones I have mixed them up, I do apologise, but as I open them I'll be able to say which ones which, if that makes sense. Okay, so in here there's one side and the other side and in your first expand the rainbow oyster you have a yellow now this one's just slightly lighter than a sunshine yellow so in between a sunshine yellow and a lemon yellow and this one is larger than the yellow that you got earlier as well let me hold him up so you can see so this is your still quite a nice bright bold yellow color there moving on to your next oyster There's one side and the other side and in here you are twinning. This is one of your natural oysters and you are twinning there. There's no more in that one. Now you're twinning with what looks to be lighter pinky rose gold pearls here. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to clean them up and I'm going to pop them straight in the stand for you. And that way you can have a look at them there. Now they do have this beautiful pink overtone to them. But I think they're base rose gold. Like I say, with that slight pink overtone. So if I hold them up so you can have a closer look. Look at those. They are beautiful. And then still three oysters to go. So, in your next oyster, there's one side, oh, and the other side, and in here you have a lighter apple green and there's no more in that one that's a lighter apple green so very summery tones and colors coming out here and then moving on to your next oyster flying piece of shell there, there we go, there's one side and the other side and in your here you are twinning for a second time and again twinning with your normal natural oyster there and you're twinning with lighter pearls, now one looks more slightly cream and one looks more bridal white. Now there's a, not a lot in it at all, but I do think that they're slightly, slightly, actually now they're in the sand, I don't think there's a lot in it. Yeah, you can see one's more bridal white, one's got that slightly cream tone to him there. Okay, so that means your last oyster must be your four pearl quadding oyster. Okay, so in here, there's one side and the other side, and in here, you are quadding, and there's no more in that one. Let me just dry these up for you. Okay, so you have a watermelon, a apple green, a icy blue, and a dark forest green. Okay, now Marlene, what do you think 
to all of these, my lovely. Now, if you would like to, would you like to take a screenshot of these? And then that way you can email me with which colours you'd like wear. And if you'd like any colour swaps or anything like that, we can include it in the email as well. I mean, if you'd like to do it now, that's absolutely fine. But if you prefer to email, that way you're not rushed at all, that's fine as well. So if I pop them on the board for you, your coral is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, he's a 6.5. Sunshine yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6. He's a 6.5 as well. And the Pepsi blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. Apple green is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. And the larger yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. Rose gold pink number one is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. And his twin, which is rose gold number two, is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven. He's a 7.5 as well. The more bridal white twin is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5. He's a seven. The slightly creamier twin is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5. He's a seven. They're measuring the same size there. Forest green is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven. He's a 7.5. Your icy blue is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5. He's an eight. The apple green is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And the watermelon is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He is a 7.5. You'd like to swap two apple greens for sea greens. That's absolutely fine. I'm guessing it's the same um, colour and size here. So give me a second. So if you take a screenshot of this here, and just of course confirm to me if these greens are okay. And then let me move these ones up because that's slightly darker down there, isn't it? What do you think to those? Looks good, okay, perfect. Let me bring you back up. So like I say, if you pop me an email over with your order number and then what colors you would like wear, and then that way I can get them all booked in for you. Uh, if that's okay so just do that whenever you're ready and then you'll get an email response from me just confirming that it's all sorted thank you for the donations of your shells as well marlene i'm just popping these on here okay and that's safe up there for you Will do. Perfect. Thank you, my lovely. Uh, right. Up next is Gemma Street. Gemma, are you here? Gemma Street, are you here? 
Oh, wow. Joanne, bless you. Thank you for the stars there. 21 week streak. Thank you, my lovely. Gemma, hello, 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 hello. You have one opening altogether. Nunu Oyster, would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells, my lovely? So your Nunu Rainbow Oyster. And let me get him open. Okay, and let's go down. So your new new rainbow oyster Gemma. There's one side. And the other side. And in here you are twinning. You're twinning with Coral Twins. Now there's no more in that one and I haven't seen what you'd like to do with the shells just yet. So I'm just going to pop them to the side while I donate the shells. Perfect. Now let me just clean up these pearls for you as well. Now what do you think to Coral Twins here? Would you be happy with one of these on your jewellery? Now again, if you're not happy, I can swap one or both of these, Gemma. That's going to be completely up to you what you would prefer to do. So here they are in the sand for you. And if I pop them on the board, coral number one is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six. Uh, he's a 6.5. And coral number two is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5. He's a seven. Uh, Marlene, I'll have a look for you in just a moment. Okay. So Gemma, what do you think to these? Yeah, I already popped them together, Sophie. Because, yeah, I, I figured she was on the um, list twice from the oysters. So I did pop them together. So I'll just go through and have another quick look. Would you like to swap one or both of them? So a dark blue or purple. Oh, that's not purple. My purple pot has got a lot of purples in it. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go through. Oh no, it's fine, Sophie. I don't think I verbalised it. So I've popped a dark blue and a blurple here, Gemma. So you can have a look and possibly pick if you prefer. So you can see the blurple's got more purple in him and then the blue to the other side. Both? Oh, which are you happy with those colours or would you prefer to have, for example, two blurples or two blues? And if you're happy with those two pearls there, which one would you prefer on the jewellery?
both of these two and blue on the jewellery, that's perfect. Let me just write that down. So we're going to have blue on there. Okay, perfect. Gemma, I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives then. That's safe on there. And thank you very, very much for the donations with your shelves, my lovely. And that's up there for you. Okay, so Marlene, we had one, two, three, four, and a four pearl. And then we had one, two, three. No, but I believe we did them all. So we've got, we had the three mystery oysters for that order. And then for the first order, we had two normal, two expand the rainbow, and a four pearl. So Marlene, I believe that's all of them there, my lovely. Okay. chairs going away with me okay Gemma you're very very welcome okay and up next then is Kelly Mabry Kelly are you here Uh, Kerry, you may need to scroll the live forward. Uh, you may have reversed slightly, like rewound, because we can rewind the live now. So if it's grey, you're watching slightly behind. So just scroll forward and you're back with us, if that makes sense. Although you won't see this for another couple of minutes. <laughs> I always forget when I say that. Uh, thank you, Sophie. Kelly, hello. Uh, Kelly, you have two openings altogether. What two oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Scoop forward. Oh, I like that. Scoop, scoop. Back red, oh bless you, Kerry. Okay, so two openings all together, Kelly. What two oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Mr. Oh, I didn't see that. Let me just thank you, Sandra, for uh, popping on my post then. Mystery, please. And you have another opening. Um, 544. Four. I don't know if I've printed. Oh, right at the back. I have printed that out. Uh, that's absolutely fine. So mystery oyster and donate. Can you just confirm is it still mystery for all four oysters. I'll pull out four oysters now. However, if it's two and two of a different two, <laughs> let me know. One, two, three, and four. Oh, normal for the other two. That's absolutely fine. So I'm just popping two mystery back. Now with the normal ones, I've just got to pop over there. So grab them. I'm just going to pop you on a back in a sec um, screen. Now, as you can see there, oh, let me grab the normal bag with me. Uh, these are old photos of customer photos who agreed at the time. Yeah, the photos. So, um, 
yeah, I thought I'd put on an interlude of back in a sec. Right, there we go. I'm just coming back again. Oh, squeaky chair. Very squeaky chair. Right, let's bring you back. Thank you for bearing with me there. It's just so you don't see me walk around, just sort of plod around the room. <laughs> That's literally it. So, normal oyster number one and number two. Let me get these open as well. and four. So are there certain colours that you're hoping for, my lovely? Okay, let's go down. So, mystery oyster number one. Oh, a nice deeper pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl straight away we can see right at the top there a beautiful light blue icy blue sorry pearl there's no more in that one so your first mystery oyster has given you a nice brighter icy blue now he's slightly two-tonal slightly lighter and brighter not a lot of two-tonal in him but he does have that slight area Moving on to mystery oyster number two, you have a lighter pop there, and in here, there's your mother of pearl. I can see that you are twinning, you are twinning with two tonal apple green twins. Oh gosh, Julie, I am 100% am wearing them. <laughs> I feel like I need to show you my knees just to prove it. <laughs> There's no more in that one. Now these are slightly too tonal. They've got some darker spots on them here. Uh, so if I just show you, this is pearl number one. You can see straight away a darker spot there and there into the lighter area then back into that two tonal section. And then pearl number two again has got these darker spots to him okay and then moving on to your two normal natural oysters so your next one there's one side and the other side and in here I can see a bridal white There's no more in that one. And oh, let me just clean that up a little bit more. So here is your bridal white. And then moving on to your last oyster, which again is your normal natural oyster. There's one side and the other side and in here you are twinning one and two twinning with rose gold twins there and there's no more in that one okay so two sets of twins and two single pearls here Kelly now again I'm just going to dry these up for you and I'm popping them in the sun so you can have a closer look. So we've got a brighter icy blue and then a bridal white. And then we've got twinning two tonal apple greens and twinning rose golds as well. Now, what do you think to these? And if you're happy with these, uh, which ones would you like where? If you're not happy, we can swap them. And if you prefer to have a think about it, you can take a screenshot of these pearls and then you can email me with your colour choices once you've made that decision. So if I pop these on the board for you, your brighter icy blue, 
is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. The bridal white is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. Two tonal apple green number 1 is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. Two tonal apple green number 2 is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. Rose gold number one is not a five, not a five point five, not a six, not a six point five, not a seven. He's a seven point five. Rose gold number two is not a five, not a five point five, not a six, not a six point five, not a seven. He's a seven point five as well. Oh, let me bring you back up so I can write that down. Rose gold on the earrings. Perfect. Uh, bridal white on there. Perfect. And lobster fittings on the rest. Okay, perfect. Kelly, I've got that down for you. And I do hope you're happy with everything. Uh, the invoice will get sent over tomorrow for you and that will go to the email address that's on the order form. Uh, so let me just pop these on here thank you for the donations of your shells as well Kelly that's safe up there for you and I do hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives uh, completed loyalty cards write your name and date across the front of them and then take a photo and send it over in an email I'll then book you in for your opening if you already have an, uh, an order that's waiting to be opened let me know in the email and I'll add it to that order. If you don't have an order, that's fine. I'll just book you in and then you'll get an email back from me just sort of saying the dates you're booked in for. I hope that makes sense. Uh, up next this evening is Lindsay Kinlock. Lindsay, and Lindsay, you are on it. You're here. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, Lindsay, you've got two openings altogether. Do you know what two oysters you would like and if you'd like to keep or if you'd like to donate your shells. What do you think? Not a problem. Two mystery donates, hoping for a surprise. Okay, so mystery oyster number one and mystery oyster number two. Let me get these open. There's one and two. And let's go down. So, your oyster number one, my lovely. Oh, can you hear that? Hang on, let me bring you to the mic. Can you hear that? I can hear the pearl moving around slightly in here. Oh, there's your mother of pearl. No wonder I can see in your first one, Lindsay, you are quadding. You have one, two, three, and four. And there's no more in that one. So your first oyster, you are quadding, Lindsay. Mandy, yay, you got your badge. I love that. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're happy with everything. Lindsay, you have a watermelon, a light apple green, a brighter lemon yellow and a darker gunmetal grey. So they're from your first oyster, which was a quadding oyster. Oh, really, Lindsay? Oh, I love that. So it's definitely a surprise. <laughs> and then moving on to mystery oyster number two. We have a lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. 
and I can see you have a brighter icy blue. And there's no more in that one. So you have a brighter icy blue. So two oysters, five pearls. Now, Lindsay, if you're not happy with any of these, I can swap them for you. And if you are happy, that's perfect. So you've got watermelon, apple green, bright lemon yellow, gunmetal grey and a icy blue. What do you think to those? If I pop them on the board, the icy blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. Watermelon is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. Apple green is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. Bright lemon yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And the dark gunmetal grey is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. What do you think to all of those? Sorry, I just had to drop something down before I forgot. <laughs> I'm at that age where I, I need to remind myself of things. Swap for apple green for a two-tonal dark blue. How dark a blue are we thinking here? Let me see if I've got any. Oh, that one. That one's two channel. I'll show you. Oh, oh. Got it. <laughs> okay, so this one here, he is a dark. Let me show you. He's a dark TARDIS blue. Oh, let me get it focused. But then as you go around, he goes into this sort of lighter blue and almost purple tones. Can we see that here? I don't know if we can see that, actually. So blue, and then you can see he's got those darker purple tones to him. Would that one be okay? You like that one? Perfect, he is yours. I'll take that green away and let me bring you back up. Uh, so thank you very, very much for donations with your shells then, my lovely. Just popping these in here for you. And I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well. That's safe on there. And then that's up there as well. Perfect. Okay, and up next then is Tracy Burns. Tracy Burns, are you here? Tracy, hello, can you have a natural and donate? And you're hoping for a bridal white. Of course you can. So, fingers crossed for a bridal white. Let's get this one open. And did we say donating the shells? Perfect. Let's go down, Tracy. So, your normal natural oyster. There's one side 
and the other side. And in here, it's not a bridal white. You have a darker pinky rose gold there. There's no more in that one. Now, if you prefer... Oh, it didn't. It missed the pearl. If you would prefer to swap this one for a bridal white, you can definitely do so. Or if you're happy with this one, that's perfect as well. So if I hold him up so you can see, he's a base darker rose gold. And he does have that slight pinky overtone to him. Tracy, what do you think to this one? If I pop him on the board for you. He's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. If you'd like to swap for a bridal white, that's absolutely fine. Oh, no, it's slightly. Yeah, that one's just slightly creamy. Okay, can you just confirm, are you happy with, sorry, I'm just trying to get so the light's not too bright. Are you happy with that one there? That's perfect, perfect. That one is yours. Let me pop him in here. Tracy, thank you for the donations with your shells as well. And I hope then you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. And that's up there for you. Perfect. Uh, and up next in this evening is Sophie. So Sophie Ogden, are you here? Excuse me. Sophie Ogden, are you here? Hello. You've got three openings all together. Mystery Oysters, donate the shells. So number one, number two, and number three. Are there certain colours, Sophie, that you're hoping for? There's number one, number two, and oh, number three. Okay, so let's go down. Mystery Oyster number one, Sophie. We have a lighter pop there. There we go. Sorry, he had a slight lip on him then. So there is your Mother of Pal. And I can see straight away we have a darker paper there. Now let me just pop him out. And if I have a squidge in here, sea greens and reds. Okay. There's no more in that one. So your first pearl, it's a darker purple by the looks of it. Let me have a closer look. Oh, he's a two-tonal purple and blue. Hopefully you can see this. So it's blue, and then we go around, and we're going to hold it against the stand so we can see, because apparently that's going to be the better viewing. So there's the purple, and then there's the blue. Quite a unique pearl there. Love it. So that's your first pearl there. Moving on to Mystery Oyster number two. We have a lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. 
and I can see in here you are twinning and you're twinning with icy blue twins I'm just going to have a squidge in here for you as well and there's no more in that one so twinning icy blue twins just going to dry them up and pop them in the sun now they do visually look like they're the same um, shade possibly the one in the center here is slightly visually larger but we will measure them at the end for you and then moving on to your last oyster which again is your mystery oyster and you have a slight double pop there and in here there's your mother of pearl and you are twinning for a second time there's no more in that one and let me just have a closer look at these colours oh wow you've got some right unusual colours here Sophie so this one is silver again I'm going to hold it against the stand uh, this one is silver and purple now he's visually larger of the twins and then his twin is silver purple and he's got some green in him as well so you've got quite unusual colors here you've got a two-tonal midnight blue and purple twinning icy blues then you've got a silver and purple then a silver green and purple Sophie what do you think to all of these now if you're happy with these just let me know which ones you'd like where and if you're not happy I can swap them for you if I pop them on the board visually smaller blue is not a 5 not a 5.5 not a 6 not a 6.5 he's a 7 visually larger blue is not a 5 not a 5.5 not a 6 not a 6.5 not a 7 he's a 7.5 so they are measuring at slightly different sizes there two tonal blue and purple is not a 5 not a 5.5 not a 6 not a 6.5 he's a 7 and then the second set of twins so this is the visually smaller but it's the silver green and purple he's not a 5 not a 5.5 not a 6 not a 6.5 not a 7 he's a 7.5 then the visually larger which is the silver and purple is not a 5 not a 5.5 not a 6 not a 6.5 not a 7 not a 7.5 not an 8 he's an 8.5 can we swap the C the light blues for sea greens and have them on the earrings and the blue purple on the bracelet of course you can let me just oh, have a look for some sea greens which are the same shade and the size here Okay, so just have a look at these and just confirm if you're happy with those. Uh, let me read that again. So, blue purple on the bracelet and the greens and the earrings. Just confirm, are you happy with those greens there? Let me bring you back up. Okay, perfect. I've got that down for you. I'm just going to pop them in here. Hoop fitting is the one we use on the necklace, Kerry. Lovely, perfect. Sophie, then, thank you for the donations with your shells. And, of course, I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well. Sorry. Oh, I've got, I had an itchy nose right here. And uh, I've, this is my trusty face itcher for while I've got oyster hands. <laughs> okay, up next then this evening is Tiffany Gardner. Tiffany, are you here? I'm just also just going to quickly print off. Uh, orders. So if you've ordered whilst we've been on the live, I'm just going to print them off 
and then I'll do an updated order list shortly because I think this is the one yeah this is the end of the order list that's on the page as at the, at the moment so let me just print these off and then I can do an updated order list for you after this opening Tiffany, hello, okay, sorry, there we go, uh, Tiffany, is that you, I can only just see your first name, Tiffany Gallant, yeah, perfect, okay, so Tiffany, you have a 25 pearl oyster, would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? And are there certain colours that you're hoping for? So let me get this one open for you. 25 pearl oh, oyster. Would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? And are there certain colours that you're hoping for? So let's go down. So here it is here. Can you keep the shells? Of course you can. Okay, so. Lighter pop there. And in here, we can already see lots of pearls in there not sure on the colors we'll see what comes out oh you've had a couple of runaways here already and that top bit of the shell did break away there so i do apologize that bit there Okay, so I'm going to clean that up properly in a moment and I'm just going to pop it to the side. Now we have had a few runners here, but I will double check everywhere in a moment. So as we can see here, lots of pearls in and around that flesh there. So let's have a squidge in here. It goes in again. I'll get all the ones that just roll off the kitchen towel in just a moment. <laughs> that one was satisfying. <laughs> Oh, dearie me. Right, I believe I think I've got them all. I'm just going to pop this here for a moment. Now, let me count them. I'm just going to move this piece of shell to the side, okay? So, one, two, one, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. 24 and 25 okay so they are all here just a couple run off the kitchen towel for a moment now I'm just going to clean these shells up like I said and then I'll have a look at these colours for you okay so if I dry these up for you Tiffany and then we'll have a closer look now I normally measure the largest and the smallest however if you'd like me to measure them all do let me know 
and if you'd like me to measure certain colours do let me know as well and bless you thank you for the stars there 14 week streak thank you my lovely so what i'm going to do tiffany is i'm going to pop them all in the sand to start with uh, we're going to pop the darker ones towards the top of the sand lighter ones towards the bottom and that's just so we can see the color contrast here okay so that's the darker ones I'm just popping the lighter ones in here as well. Okay, largest and smallest is fine. Perfect. Okay, so if I hold these up for you to start with, now if you'd like to take a screenshot here, you can do so. Like I say, I will go through the colours one by one just so we can see what colours you do have here. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to pop it down so we can go through them. So pearl number one is a darker forest green. Oh, let's just get this to focus. There we go. So he's a darker forest green. You then have a silver pearl. You then have a dark chocolate bronze. So he does have that bronze tone through to him. You then have a lighter chocolate bronze. We then have a dark two-tonal purple and green. So let me get this to... So he's purple and green as you go around the pearl there. You then have this chocolate bronze, almost like a brick. I'm going to have to hold this up so we can see. Chocolate bronze brick colour there. So it's slightly different to the two bronzes that are at the top. You then have a dark olive green. And again, another silver, slightly darker than the first silver. You have a lighter silver, so again, lighter. So three different silvers, three different tones. And then you've got a dark gunmetal grey with slight purple overtone. We then have a light, almost like a latte chocolate. A light Pepsi blue, slightly two tonal with Smurf blue there. And then you have a coral. Now, because of their lighter colours, I am just going to pop this down again. You then have a bridal white and a two-tonal pinkle. So it's lighter here. Then it does go round into this pinkle colour. So two-tonal cream and pinkle. You have a lemon yellow and then a coral. You then have a watermelon and a candy floss pink, a lighter baby pink, that's just a piece of sand I've just picked up there as well. You have a darker rose gold, again that's just a piece of sand there. You have a two tonal autumn peach and yellow. So as you go around, go into the autumn peach, then back into the yellow. You have a light apple green. A pinkle. And ending on a lighter icy blue. Tiffany, what do you think to all of these? Now I'll go through and measure the largest and the smallest for you just confirm if you're happy with all of those colors so visually smallest we're going to go for the coral to start with he's not a 5 not a 5.5 .5, not a 6 not a 6.5 he's a 7 go for the yellow next to him he's not a 5 not a 5.5 .5, not a 6 he's a 6.5 okay we're going to measure the pinkle he's not a 5 not a 5.5 .5, not a 6 not a 6.5 he's a 7 uh, and we'll measure the white as well. He's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, not a 6.5. He's a 7. So the smallest is a 6.5 with your yellow there. Then moving on to the largest, we're going to measure this two-tonal purple and green. He's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6. Whoa, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. Uh, we're going to measure the two-tonal pinkle. He's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6. Not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. 
So your smallest is a 6.5, your largest is an 8. I don't know if my comments have stopped or... What do you think to those, my lovely? Email swaps, of course you can. Uh, what I'll say is, let me bring you back up. If you pop, if, if you've managed to grab a screenshot there, if not, have a look at the timestamp. It is one twenty-one now, so just go back five ten minutes, um, and then you can watch it back if you wanted to. But yeah, email me across with your order number and then what colours you'd like and what colours to swap out, and I can definitely do that for you. Okay. Just popping these all in the bag. Perfect. Okay, I'm going to wrap up your shelves as well for you, Tiffany. So I do hope you'll be happy oh, with everything once it arrives. Oh, fudge sticks. <laughs> sort that out in just a second <laughs> okay so your shelves are nicely wrapped up here for you and that's your name on them so like I say Tiffany okay perfect I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives What's happened is I have like a little, um, I can't, I have like a little tub for my staples, uh, it slots into my pin board, but um, it just fell off into the oyster shells and flesh that I'm keeping there to clean off later, <laughs> so that's great. <laughs> okay, so I've cleaned it up now, it's fine. Um, I'll sort it out later. Oh, Emma, very welcome. Fudge sticks. Well, yeah, have to change your vocabulary when you have kids, Kerry. <laughs> okay, right. Up next is uh, Kerry Palmer. Kerry, are you here? Brilliant, perfect, Kerry. Marie, thank you for the stars there. 12 weeks straight. Thank you, my lovely. Uh, and Kerry, you have two openings altogether. What two oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? What do you think, Kerry? So you've got two openings all together. What two oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Good evening, Amy. Expand and a mystery and donate. Kerry, is there certain colours that you're hoping for? Oops, so an expand 
and a mystery. Let me get these open for you. There's number one and number two. And let's go down. So your mystery oyster, we have oh, a lighter, there we go, lighter pop there. And in here, oh, a runaway with a brighter coral pearl there. There's your mother of pearl. Now I'm just going to have a squidge in here as well, see if there's any more in here. And there's no more in that one. So you have a brighter coral to start with. And then moving on to oyster number two, which again is your expand the rainbow oyster. Oh. There's one side. And the other side. Oh, and in here, you are twinning and you are twinning with lighter autumn peach twins and there's no more in that one okay so lighter autumn peach twins and a brighter coral now you just said that you'd prefer to have one of the ones that are in the swap uh, swap pot so if you would like to have that one do let me know in which color you'd like to swap out and if you're happy with the rest, that's absolutely fine. If not, do let me know. And I will need to know which one you'd like on your fitting, Kerry, as well. So brighter coral and autumn peach twins. If I pop them on the board for you, autumn peach number one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six. So here's a 6.5. Autumn peach number two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, here's a seven. So I'm measuring at slightly different sizes there. Oh, and then coral number one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six. He is a 6.5. What do you think? Oh, two of those. How strange, it looks like I've got lines on my top. Oh, no, not if I shade it. My top is a solid block colour yellow. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool actually. Swap peach number one. Okay, and there's the pinky rose gold. That's the only one I've got in my swap, so that's definitely the correct one there. Can you confirm, Kerry, are you happy with all of those there? The swap pot today is very, very lighter sort of pastely swaps in here what do you think Kerry can you confirm are you happy with those three I'm just going to pop them in here for you And the other two on lobsters as well. Oh, 
okay that's absolutely fine I've got that down for you and you'd like the swap on there that's perfect um, so the invoice for that Kerry will get sent through tomorrow for you and it will go to the email address that's on the order form okay uh, that's safe at there as well so like I say I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives okay perfect oh where's my uh itch <laughs> sorry uh perfect curry no you're very very welcome uh right up next then is oh so sorry that one caught me not prepared let me just have a sip of my drink here Okay, right. Ever so sorry. That literally caught me unprepared. <laughs> Snuck up on me. Uh, right, up next is Wendy Walker. Wendy, are you here? Oh. Wendy, hello. So you have one, two, three openings all together. So number one, number two, and number three. Let me get this open for you. No, I'm not that tired. That's the thing. <laughs> I'm not. I've, I've slept. Yeah, I've slept. Um... So yeah, I don't, oh, hopefully I don't look too tired. So yeah, I just think it's, maybe I need to crack a window. So Wendy, let's go down. Would like to donate the shells. Are there certain colours that you're hoping for? So Mystery Oyster number one. Lighter double pop there. And there's your mother of pearl. Now I can see you have a darker pearl down the bottom here. Oh, and you have no, no more in that swim. If we dry him up, he is definitely a darker silvery gunmetal grey there. Thank you, bub. So dark silvery gunmetal grey to start with. Moving on to oyster number two. You have a lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. And I can see you straight away, you have a lighter purple. And again, I'm just going to have a squidge in here for you and there's no more in that swim. So a darker gunmetal grey silver and then a lighter purple. And then the last of your mystery oysters, Wendy. You have a lighter pop there. There's your mother of pearl. And in here, you have a coral and there's no more in that one okay so a darker silver a light purple and a coral now wendy would you like to take a screenshot of these here for me that way you've just got those to to refer back to for in a moment if that's okay let me pop them on the board for you as well so your darker silver is not a five not a 5.5 .5, not a six he's a 6.5 
the purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And your coral is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7 as well. Now, if I just bring you back up again quickly. Oh, swap the silver and coral for bright icy blues for the earrings. Of course you can. Just have a look at these here. Can you just confirm if you're happy with those for me? What's going on with my sock today? It keeps trying to fold up. <laughs> so perfect perfect so blues on the earrings let me just write that down okay so you then have a 25 pearl oyster wendy now with your 25 pearl oyster would you like to keep or would you like to donate those shells and um, are there certain colors you're hoping for with this one so 25 pearl oyster bag. And here it is. Let's get this one open. And let's go back down again. Okay, so what do you think? keep this shell that's absolutely fine not a problem my lovely so in here oh double lighter softer pop there and we can see a few in here let's pop him down and open him up oh only one runaway now i'll clean that shell off in just a second so one runaway there and we can see lots of pearls in and around that flesh there let's have a squidge oh pop these out for you So I'm just having a squidge around. Okay, I don't believe there's any more in there. So let me just count these up for you, Wendy. So we've got one, two, actually I'm going to put them up here because I don't want them rolling off. So one, two, three. Oh, you guys can't see that. Let me move the shell over. So <laughs> one, two, oh. one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. I'm gonna to have to count them again because I think I went backwards. <laughs> Smallest and largest is fine. Thank you, Wendy. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and 23. Okay, so what's going to happen then, my lovely? 
is it does only have 23 pearls in it and I'm just going to double check in and around I didn't think I saw any roll off no okay so what's going to happen is you get to have an additional two oysters as well because obviously this is meant to be a 25 pearl oyster and only 23 was in that oyster now they are scanned uh, and they are cultured oysters but obviously these things can happen so because of that we do offer uh, so like I say you're, you're down two pearls if you like if you want to say it that way so you can we do offer you an, an additional two oyster openings and that way it makes up up to the 25 and possibly more pearls because obviously if you get um, twinning or anything in the extra openings you get to keep those as well I hope that makes sense so I do apologize that there's not the 25 in that oyster but after we've gone through these Wendy um, what I'll do actually is I'll pop these all in the sand and then we'll open up the mystery ones as well and then I'll go through all the colours if that's okay. So, if I pop, would you like to keep or would you like to donate the mystery oysters? I'm going to pop these in the sand, darkest to the top and then oh, lightest at the bottom and then at the very bottom will be the pearls from the mystery oyster as well, making up to the 25 you've got some lovely colours here beautiful two tonal ones as well oh missed the darker one there donate those ones okay so if I hold these up for you first just so you can have a quick look at those if you would like to take a screenshot of just those ones, you can do so. I'll just hold them there a moment. Then I'm just going to bring you back up so we can grab two mystery oysters and then open those, pop all the pearls in together so we can see them all together. I am sorry that that, that, that has happened though, Wendy. So, two extra oysters here. Number one and oh, number two. Let me get these open. There's one and two and let's go back down again. So, mystery oyster number one. Oh, quite a nice deep pop was that one. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. Uh, you are twinning. Twinning with your first mystery oyster, which brings you up to those 25 pearls. So we're going to have, there's no more in that one. We're going to have over 25 pearls now. So I hope that sort of makes up for it. Again, I do apologise. So you have darker silver twins there. And visually, they are slightly different sizes. I'll just show you them at the bottom. And then moving on to oyster number two, which again is your mystery oyster lighter pop there there's your mother of pearl and in here you have another darker pearl there and there's no more in that one so you have a darker silver again so from your mystery oysters you've got three darker silvers so what i'm going to do again wendy is if i'm going to hold them up for you and if you would like to take a screenshot you can do so if you're not happy with any of these colors we can swap them for you and if you prefer to have a think about it and then email me them just let me know and i can write that down then that's not a problem but of course if you're happy with these that's perfect as well so if we go through all of the colours for you, uh, so we'll do the mystery oysters first because they're just at the bottom here. So mystery oyster twin number one is this darker silver. Twin number two again is a darker silver. And then the third, well the second oyster but third pearl is again a darker silver. So dark silvers from your mystery oysters. Going to the top here, you've got a two tonal gunmetal grey which just means it's slightly lighter and darker grey as you go around the pearl there 
and then you've got this deep darker chocolate we then have again another darker gunmetal grey quite larger pearls there we'll measure those two at the end you've got a slightly two tonal chocolate bronze with lighter and darker areas as you go around the pearl and then you've got a dark chocolate and olive green pearl there so he's got that two tonal olive green colours coming through you then have a silver and again slightly darker silver there so two more silvers you then have a deeper burgundy red we have a two tonal tardis and pepsi blue so you can definitely see those lighter and darker tones as you go around the pearl there you have a sea green and then you have a two tonal apple green so again lighter and darker as you go around the pearl there you've got this beautiful lighter watermelon so it's almost like a pinky coral but it's just a lighter watermelon and then you have a bright deep icy blue we have a pinkle which is a mix between a pink and a purple and then you have a cream you have a darker grape purple and then you have a two-tonal gold so this is a lighter gold and he's got those lighter silvery tones coming through as well oh you have a baby pink and then a lighter purple a autumn peach again slightly two-tonal with the autumn peach then you do have a definite two-tonal coral a brighter watermelon so you have the lighter watermelon up here so that's the brighter watermelon and then you have a candy floss pink okay so Wendy what do you think to all of these and then of course I'll need to know as well uh, what color you'd like on your other items we've got the blues down for the earrings what color would you like on the other item Oh bless you, sorry Wendy, that didn't come through first time. Email me the choices for the bracelet fittings if that's okay. Of course, that's absolutely not a problem. Let me bring you back up. Uh, again, if you, t if you manage to take a screenshot there, uh, you can just refer back to that in the email. Or the time stamp is 1 hour 49. Uh, so if you go back, uh, I'll say 10-15 minutes and then you can see all of those colours coming out and going through them again there if that's helpful at all my lovely okay but yeah when you email me if you include your five digit order invoice number and then we can get that all sorted for you okay I'm just going to wrap up your 25 pearl oyster shells as well Okay, perfect. So that's safe up there for you, Wendy. Uh, thank you for the donations. I didn't measure them. Oh. <laughs> oh, I was all. I was. I was. My brain was thinking about the um. The fact that it was twenty three in them. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get them back out. However, they're not going to be in colour order, but we can definitely look at the sizes. So I'm just going to sprinkle them in the sand here. I quite like them when they're all mixed up. So let's go back down. So what I did is I've just sprinkled them <laughs> a bit haphazard. 
Um, and we're just going to measure the, the the largest ones, definitely these darker ones. He's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's not an 8. He's an 8.5. The second darker one is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. And the smallest, measure your silver, he's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6. He's a 6. Point five. The other silver is not a five, not a five point five, not a six. He's a six point five, and the autumn peach is not a five, not a five point five, not a six, not a six point five. He's a seven. The bright watermelon is not a five, not a five point five, not a six, not a six point five. He's a seven. So your largest is a eight point five, and the smallest is a six point five. So sorry. I'm just popping them back in. There we go. Oh, don't, oh bless you. It's done now. <laughs> well, I hope you'll be happy, Wendy, with everything once it arrives, my lovely. There we go. And that's safe up there for you as well with your shelves as well. Um, let me just refresh this. I think that's actually the end of our order list today. I just realised that that order's booked in for a different day. Um, so yeah, that's the end of our order list. Let me come back to you. I've just refreshed that page. So thank you everyone for watching. We're going to be live again on Sunday evening, slightly earlier time at 7.30 BST. Um, and like I say, keep an eye out on the website. We've got lots coming up. Uh, new events starting next week and uh, new stock coming too. So I hope you'll have a brilliant weekend uh, and I'll see you on Sunday. Take care, be safe, bye.